I was inspired by the first, you know, the original film. Obviously, I loved that film. I loved the Jerry Goldsmith score, for goodness sake. So following in his footsteps. Um, but that's not really the reason I am involved. The reason I'm involved is because I was asked to be involved by Nikki Cara. Um, and, and the reason she asked me is that we had just worked together. We had just done a film uh, called The Zookeeper's Wife together and had a really good experience on that. Nikki always wanted this to be an emotional tale uh, and for the music and the story to be told from the point of view of Mulan, from top to bottom, really. So, um, yeah, if ever I was confused or unsure about what I should be doing, I'd look at Mulan, look into her eyes on the screen and see what it was that was going through her mind. So the score's really, really driven from her point of view, as, as is the film. Um, and her emotional arc is really, and her, uh, um, her journey uh, is one that the music tracks. I'd say that if, if, this, if the score can be unique, it's because of the film is pretty unique. You know, it, it, um, the film has, it has, a, um, has everything you expect from a, a sort of epic. Um, but a little bit more than that, because of, of Nikki being the director, um, I think she brings to it um, more than it being an action epic adventure. It's, it's, it's got a huge heart to it um, and a good sense of humour where it needs to as well.